This is a, a diagram that talks a little bit about how Bookkeeper works internally. One of the really unique aspects of Bookkeeper and its storage design is that it has two different pools of disk and that it works very hard to segment, to, to separate our writes from our reads. And the main takeaway from, from this diagram here is to say that what we call the Bookkeeper Journal, this is where we're our fast write path. And this is where we get high durability, but this does not need to be a very large disk. We want fast, and but can be small storage. But our write path only hits this disk versus our read path. And, and after that hits that disk, it's eventually flushed into the underlying long-term storage, what we, what we call the ledger disk. And this ledger disk is between plus memory caches is only really used from reads. But the main takeaway is that Pulsar works very hard, and I should say Bookkeeper, to separate the reads and writes from like an IO perspective. And why this is important in a streaming system is that if you have an influx of data, of new data you need to write, if that impacts your read performance and causes you to get behind, well, now you kind of can be in somewhat of a bad place where you can't read fast enough to catch up because you have this new increase in data. Or likewise, maybe you need to, to do a whole bunch of reads to catch up. If that impacts your write performance, then you're then you're going to start dropping writes, you know, have issues. So by having these separate things, these separate IO paths for reads and writes, that's really what allows Pulsar to allow for very high read throughput that won't impact your write throughput when you need to use it. 